Hey guys, I'm Marty Geek, and this video is that time of the month where I like to share with you the games that I enjoyed the most during the month, right? So now we're talking about March 2023, and this month I've really been playing a lot of gaming, especially on these two bad boys right here. Uh, so first of all, on the Nintendo Switch, the game that I was playing at the beginning of the month because it this Kirby game... Dream to Dreamland, uh, Return to Dreamland, actually came out late last month, so I was definitely playing it a lot, this game, especially during the beginning of March and almost to the mid-March, right? Um, I was playing this game, really good, really good game, very well done, beautiful, gorgeous game, nice platforming, and it's really nice if you love Kirby, I'm pretty sure you're going to love this game. Um, then... During mid, I would say mid uh, month of March, we got uh, the demo, which was save crossover, right? For Bayonetta, Ceresa, uh, Origins, Ceresa, and the Lost G Demon. Uh, came out, played the demo, loved it, got the full game when it came out. Also been playing a couple of chapters already. So I think I'm uh, like around chapter five, I think I'm on this game. I haven't been playing it that much like I would love to because there's been I've been splitting myself between so many games that, you know, there's too many little time for me during the day. And of course, this game just came out a couple days ago and, and, all, and already I've spent so many hours playing Road to the Show, uh, March to October, and I started playing the new storylines of Negro Leagues, which is also very, very, very cool. But of course, this game I will still I'm still gonna be playing this game on April a lot. So on the Nintendo Switch, these are the three games that I played the most. And so far, my favorite game so far of these three games, I gotta say the show. <laughs> I can't have the I can't you know the show can't be on the lineup and not be my favorite game. So for me, the show, even though it did come out a couple of days ago, I just keep coming back to it. And when I'm not playing it, I wanna be playing it. Very, very Ooh, awesome game. Um, for VR, for VR, I got this here for the first time in one of my videos because um, VR came out late last month and I haven't been playing too many games on the PlayStation VR. Uh, the only game that I've been playing is the game that came with the bundle, which is Horizon Call of the Mountain. Uh, is it Call of the Mountain? Yes, Call of the Mountain. And it's been really cool, believe me, even though that game is actually not that long. I still haven't finished the game at all, but I did enjoy it. I am enjoying the game, um, playing it slowly, but I am actually enjoying the game. And honestly, on the VR, that's the only game I've been playing all month, ever since it came out. But it's a pretty good game. I'm liking it. On the, on, the, on the Steam Deck, Steam Deck, I've been playing so many amazing games, right? But, you know, there's been, like, some of the great games that I've been enjoying. Like, for example, like a Dragon Ishin. That game came out late last month. And I played, been playing lots of it. Like, see here, 35.2 hours. And that went all the way through mid March all the way through, through mid March, and after that, WWE 2K23 came out, which is one of my favorite franchises. I love WWE, and so far I've been playing a whole bunch of it every day ever since it came out. So I stopped playing Ishin, went to W2K3, and I've been playing almost every single mode in this game, loving it, loving it. So far, 22.3 hours, but. Another game came out, right? Just a couple days ago. I would say, what, last week? Resident Evil 4. And look at that. Now it's actually now it's actually playable. When I when it came out, it was not playable. And right now, right now it's actually considered playable. And been loving it. Love the upgrades that they did, they've been doing to this game. I love the addition, additional scenes and additional missions they add to this remake of resident evil 4 which is one of my favorite games ever ever and i've been loving it so far let me see where i'm at you know i'm with um you know i'm with her right here oh yeah this is like the how you call this section it's like uh the garden and it's where it's like a labyrinth if you know uh, a labyrinth garden if you know those two words together you know where i'm at <laughs> it's like a labyrinth garden very very cool love it beautiful 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 game great cutscenes 
and it's just amazing that's the game that i barely was playing right before i actually recorded this video so i i put this game down to actually start recording this video that's how much I, i've been enjoying that game and basically that said those are all the games that i've been enjoying during the month of april these three games kirby Ceresa and the lost dragon mlb the show for the switch for the vr horizon call of the mountain steam deck Ishing, wwe 2k23 and resident evil 4 yes baby so let me know in the comments what are you expecting to play on april i'm expecting to play star wars for survivor and the for the nintendo switch uh advanced wars one and two i think advanced war one one and two oh, yeah. but definitely i can't wait to play star wars survivor but that comes out late 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 next month let me know in the comments what did you enjoy during the month of March. Thanks for watching. Till next time, guys. Bye-bye.